Hey, what's up guys? Um, you know what, today I thought it'd be fun to do a tattoos and piercings update because, you know, some things have changed. Um, I got some new tattoos and I also lost a few piercings on the way through this journey of disappointing my mom. So, let me, let's just, let's just get right into it, okay? Um, basically, I am sick. Sorry, if I sound like I'm out of breath and I'm sniffling and I sound disgusting, you know what? I'm sorry, <laughs> but um, I took out my nose piercing, yes I had my nose pierced and I took it out because homegirl just kept getting infected, like I loved my nose piercing so much but it just wouldn't heal. Because my nose wouldn't heal, I just was like let me just take this out because I was putting more money into fixing the problem than actually seeing results, so I took my nose piercing out. And my septum, I still have my septum, I just don't wear it as often because I find myself doing a lot of really like extreme makeup looks lately and my septum will just like put it, put it over the top and I'm just not trying to look crazy 24-7 but I still have my septum and it's still there. I still wear it occasionally, just not as much. And for tattoos, the part you're probably most interested in Yes, um, as you can see, I don't know if it's focused, but you know what, I'll put better pictures in. But um, I have this snake, yes. It has really nice detail, I freaking love it, and this rose. So it's just a snake and a rose, and the lines are so clean, and I've never been happier with any of my tattoos because, as y'all know, I have a few prison tats on my ankle, and I have one on my side. But... Yeah, this tattoo, honestly, it was done by an amazing artist. Shout out to Jordan from Old Crow Tattoo in Oakland. Yep, so right when I turned 18, I drove my happy ass to freaking Oakland and I got a tattoo. And um, my best friend Kayla came with me and it was a good day, except for when I got home and my mom literally was wanted to kill me. But you know what? It was worth it because she's kind of over it now. She says it's a biker tattoo, but... You know what, what's so wrong about being in a biker gang because like, welcome to a biker gang, you know, like, so if I get approached by a biker gang someday and they're like, hey, I like your tattoo, want to join our freaking gang, I'll be like, heck yeah, man, this is what I signed up for when I got this tattoo. When my grandma saw it and when my tia saw it, they kind of were just like, yep, this is our, um, this is our family. This is my granddaughter and this is my niece. Hi. <laughs> so, yeah, um, a lot of people in my family weren't happy with the tattoo. My grandma, my other grandma, who lives here, she literally was just, she just didn't even have words. She just looked at me and she was just like, I can't believe you did that. Oh my god. I'm so mad. She just went on and on about how disappointed she was. And she called my dad and she was like, what is this? And I was like, dad, just tell her it's real. And he's like, no, no, it's, it was, it's fake. It's a fake tattoo. And then she was like, I know it's real. And then he was like, no, 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 it's on. Yeah, but she knows it's real too. I don't really care about what other people think, even though... I love my family, I love you guys, but I know you guys don't like it that much, you guys aren't a fan, but I like it, and that's all that matters. Maybe I won't like it when I'm like 50 or 70, but you know what, when I'm 50 or 70, I plan on just sitting indoors all day and eating cake, because when you're 70, like, what else are you gonna do? And, um, I got another one on my arm, Grandma, family, y'all don't know about this. But my mom knows because she saw it already and she already had her mental breakdown. So if this is your first time seeing it, I'm sorry. But um, I'll put a picture in too. It says dreaming and it's in red ink. Um, a little cheesy to some of you guys. I know you're going to be like, what the heck? What are you dreaming about? Like, bitch, wake up. But I'm just going to tell you. Um, I spend a lot of my life just dreaming. Literally, I have so many things in my head that I just dream about, I daydream. 
And when I walk around, like I, I like to tell people like I'm not rude. I'm literally just in my own world. I'm shy and I'm quiet. So when I go out in public alone, when I'm alone, I'm always just thinking and dreaming about the future, dreaming about what's gonna be. And that's like, this tattoo is kind of like, this is like the real tattoo that has a meaning. Like all my other tattoos really don't have a meaning. But this one, as small and um, not that great as it is, um, it has a lot of meaning to me. Okay, not to get cheesy on y'all, but point is, I spent a lot of my life just dreaming about what's to come and what's gonna be. And then this is just like a reminder, like, girl, keep dreaming because like, it's gonna happen someday. And yeah, just stay positive, peace, love, gang, gang, you know? So um, besides these two, these are new, I got one, um, I got one in the middle of my chest. Okay, you know what, family, just exit this video. Like, I know I already disappointed you guys enough. Just go, just leave. Don't share this video with anybody. I know you all hate me. But yes, I have a tattoo in the middle of my chest. Um, it's, um, it's not that provocative. So I can just show you guys. It is a heart, just a small heart. It's not on my actual boobs. It's just a small heart here. I've always wanted a heart in the middle of my chest. I don't draw, I can't draw. I have no talent in drawing at all. Whenever I doodle, whenever I'm sad, whenever I like a boy, I'll start drawing hearts and my favorite color is red. And I like hearts, I like everything they mean and represent. I like love, I like loving people and giving love. And you know, in cartoons, the character's heart is always right here. So I was like, let me get a tattoo in the middle of my chest where people usually think hearts are. Because I think hearts are like, on your left side, I think hearts are here, like right here, here. I don't know. So I know this video was short, but I just wanted to make a quick little video updating you guys on my body art because I know I'm gonna get more tattoos and I know I'm gonna keep disappointing my mom and my family. And I love you guys and I'm sorry if you hate tattoos, but I love them. And thank you so much for watching my videos. Thank you so much for coming down because I'm going to Disneyland on October 3rd. So if you wanna come on down, Come on down, subscribe, um, or don't.